<laughs> across over there. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you guys for being here. I'm currently in my garden. Luna's over there rolling in the grass. The last vlog I post was the Christmas decoration haul. I ended up taking a break and but now I'm back. It is springtime now. We are in March. It's about to be April. This is the last day of March actually filming on Easter. I actually planted some pumpkins and they're growing. I also bought some plants that I need to actually put into the ground. I finally got a bird feeder and I put it in the tree in my front yard. I actually caught um, a few birds visiting it this morning, even a squirrel. I think I got a, um, a woodpecker that was just like climbing around the tree. I saw some blue jays. I wasn't able to get the blue jays on video, but I did get a bunch of like sparrows and a bunch of really cute small birds. I'll show you some of the plants that I have growing. I just spent about 10 minutes making this really cute flat lay here. I'm gonna be putting all my seeds and my tools in it. I also just remembered that I have some fruit over here. I have blueberries, some hydrangea, and this is a rose bush. Oh my God, this is already growing a blueberry. I really need to plant this like ASAP. I have my wheelbarrow. I'm just gonna put them over here. I'm gonna dump out this nasty water now. Gardening's hard. I'm gonna go ahead and put as many store-bought plants that I got in here. I've had some decorative cabbage and a bunch of other stuff that I got and I just never got around to planting it. Right there. There you go. Put this guy here. Like right there is better. There you go. I don't know what that is, but they look like little seeds or something. Oh yeah, they're definitely seeds. It's pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna put my little fox ferns in here too. Oh my god. Do you guys see that? What what is happening to this fox fern? I'm just gonna stick it in here. So have this strawberry plant big well here. Oh, that's a little deep. Let me. This is sage on there for a while. Kind of got dirt all over the cabbage, but this is what it's looking like. A strawberry, I have a little daisy, decorative cabbage, two foxtail ferns, this is rosemary, I have two scabiosas here, it's a snapdragon, this is a decorative cabbage, and then another daisy right there. You guys, gardening is so hard. I feel like it's been two hours and all I've done is planted one planter and I still have all these seeds. I need to just put them in the ground and let them grow. I have plenty of bed space. I'm just gonna do it. So I'm gonna plant these, foxglove, lupine, and cosmos. But these seeds are lupine. Basically just put them in there. The dirt in here. This is basically sand. It looks like sand. Patch it up. They look like sunflower seeds. This is the whole thing too, because a lot of these plants. It's really nice. Hi guys, so it is June now and it's been a couple months since I've vlogged. So as you can see in the background, my pumpkins are thriving, they're taking over 
and they're just all over the place. I'm gonna give you guys a little tour in just a second. I just wanted to come on and give you guys an update of what the garden is looking like currently. So I planted my garden like early April and like late April and then it thrived in May. Like I got so much growth in May. I'll insert some clips here and there of what the garden looked like in May. And then now we're in June and I wanted to show you what it looks like because I'm so proud of it and Every time I come out here, I just get this sense of calmness. Just everything that I hope this garden to be, is it's becoming like a big deal for me. And I'm just so proud of it and I want to share that with you guys. And of course, eventually I want to expand my garden. This is all I could really manage um, this year. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys a little bit of what the garden looks like. So as you can see, I have two beds of pumpkins. Both of these beds were actually made up of seeds that I got from my pumpkins I decorated last um, fall. And once they started to rot, I kind of just mixed it in with the soil and let the seeds just take off on their own. And they really did. They're taking over. It's so crazy. Let me show you what I'm talking about over here. Here's a better look at them. Um, I did make this archway here so that the vines could climb up but as you can see the vines are actually starting to reach towards my house like into this wall they're trying to get as high up as they can what I'm probably gonna end up doing is either trimming them or like redirecting them back towards the trellis over there I don't know if you guys have any tips on how to manage pumpkin vines let me know when i said realistic i meant realistic gardening this is what my daisies look like right now as soon as i cut off like all of these three more will pop up so that's really nice over here as well here's my cabbage something's been eating it so i gotta figure that out sage though is oh the sage is beautiful it's really happy there as well as my strawberry this is actually a fake strawberry it's called a faux strawberry um, it actually died but it came back so it's looking pretty happy there i did plant these very close together so that could explain why some aren't as happy as others this is very alarming i don't know what is eating my cabbage but it's making me sad so i gotta go figure out what to put on there this was a foxglove and my foxtail ferns of course look really happy rosemary looks really happy mint is doing well I just gotta take care of these poor little cabbages. Snapdragon is looking happy, and these pin cushions could be happier, but I think they're doing okay right now. Sometime in the near future, I'm gonna go ahead and trim some of these vines because they're looking a little cray cray. My realistic garden, I do have some pests that I'm gonna take care of actually right now. I have some neem oil and some dish soap. That I'm gonna use so yeah wish me luck and over here my lovely calla lilies um, are blooming really nicely as well I planted some seeds down here but of course my um, pumpkins took over so I gotta see what's going on I planted like rows of them but they haven't really sprouted except for this little row right here and honestly I can't remember what it was either <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that bell icon so you know when I upload next. The next vlog will be about traveling to England and Europe, and I'm really excited for that vlog because it was my first time traveling to Europe, and it was so cool and so beautiful, and I want to share that with you all. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!